dogs going in the hole. Check, check, you got him? You got him? Yeah, take the shot. So in the last video, we took the 400D out for a little insect photography. Say, what can you do with a 16-year-old camera? And it was hard. It was very hard. But you can still get the shots. And I kept saying all the way through that video is, the newer cameras just make it easier to get the shot. And we're going to test that out in this video. I'm going to pass my daughter Jessica, my Canon EOS R, with the Canon 100mm macro lens on. And we're going to see what type of shots that my nine-year-old daughter can get out of this camera. Okay, so what we're going to do here is we're going to set it up so that the camera does most of the work. So I'm going to go to, let me think, what's more important? You want to get one in, in, in flight. So you want to capture something like a dragonfly in flight, we want a high shutter speed. So I'm going to go with shutter priority mode, I think is going to be the best, best one for her. And I'm going to set your shutter to 1000, okay? We're then going to set the ISO to auto. And then what's going to happen there is the camera is going to choose your f-stop and your ISO for you. So the other thing I'm going to do is turn off all the information in there. So if you look for that viewfinder now, finger goes there for the shutter, okay? If you look for the viewfinder now, can you see a little square dot? No. Do you want the battery finger off so it's lighter? Yeah? I'm quite okay, nice, but... Okay, fill that now. Well, did, are you, do you prefer to do it like an iPhone? Yeah, you know, like you see the screen here. Yeah? Okay, right. So you're not going to use the EVF, okay? So we're going to use it like an iPhone. Basically, she's going to be a Manny Ortiz. You can see on the back screen here, is that little square? All right, that's wherever your focus is going to go. Okay? So, when, so if you look there, no matter where you point it, look, see? It's going to auto-focus on it. Mm -hmm. So what we're going to do is we're going to go sit over there, where you saw those dragonflies, yeah. When the dragonfly is coming, you're going to put that square onto the dragonfly and press the button. What if it doesn't work? It, it won't work every time. It won't work every time, but we are going to give it a go. Okay, so you hold that. Right. Okay, so unfortunately, this is the best camera angle we can get from where we are, but this is a very good place to sit to watch these dragonflies go back and forward. So Jessica, so you want to use it like a mobile phone. So you're going to hold it like that. And you can see your little focus square on the back of the screen, yeah? Mm -hmm. And what you do is when we wait here, it might take a few minutes for the dragonflies to settle down because we've just uh, moved here. And then as a the dragonfly comes over, you're going to put that little box over the dragonfly, press that button to take a shot. Think off. And then link off. Okay. Yeah, right. Take it. Put the square where you want the focus it's to be. Slow. Put your finger there. Where? On there. <laughs> right, you have to half press it. Okay. If you press it half in, can you feel it how it stops halfway? That's telling you that you, you want to focus where you are. So you press it halfway. No, that's take a picture. You press it halfway for it to focus, and then you'll be able to see what you're looking okay. at, okay? So all you got to do now, you just got to wait for these dragonflies to come and land. Or damselfly, you can have a damselfly if you want one. Yeah. Do you want to sit on my knee? Listen, Dama. Do you want to sit on my knee? You don't trust me, do you? No, I don't trust you. There's also another perch over there we can look at if this one doesn't work out. Okay. So you got damselfly just there. It's got to come towards us. Yeah, it might land. You might see one in the breeze, actually. Yeah. Wait for him to land. <laughs> okay, you're a little bit too eager. <laughs> a little bit too eager. Come here, what you want to do is you want to bring it forward like that. Yeah. Okay, so you do that now. Okay, on the okay. same one? Yeah. Okay. So. Oh, it's took off. It took off. I almost went in. <laughs> okay, go, go. Oh, no, no, no. He's fighting. You're not going to get him while he's fighting. The dragonflies are coming back. Here's one. There. 
Oh, he's gonna have an iPhone bro. He's coming to the tree. Calm down. You got it? You gotta get closer than that, Jess. That's it. Lean in there. Put that square right on him and take a picture. He's run away. Very skittish they are today, ain't they? Compared to the other day. Let's go over there and have a look at what there is, yeah? Come on. When we were doing that other video, they were all over the place. It was all coming in close here. Yeah? Well, now they're not doing it for some reason. Is it because of that dog? You reckon the dog disturbed them? You can look through there as well if you look. Feed. Mm -hmm. half, half press that to focus. Yeah? He landed on Mate, that perch that's there. Do you all are going down there? Shall we go down? I am not going down. <laughs> you went there. You won't get that shot. Not unless you've got a massive lens, you won't get the shot. You can see us doing stuff and he just has the dog jump in the water. Oh. Right, we're not going to go after that one because if you chase after him, you're going to move out your spot, yeah? And you don't want to do that, you just want to sit still in the spot and wait, wait for him to come because if there's one that keeps landing there, yeah? You've just got to be waiting, be patient, just wait. See? Look for the viewfinder and find the damselfly, put the, put the square on the damselfly and then take the picture. Calm down, calm down, keep going, keep going because he hasn't moved. Carry on. You never assume you've got the shot, just keep going. Okay, I think that's enough. <laughs> <laughs> well, you've missed focus. That square has to go right on where the damsel fly is. So, there you are, try, try it again. This one would be too far back. You'll practice with it, see if you can get the shot anyway. Just use it for practice. That's it. Move slowly. Can you see it? It's fine. It's gone. Mm -hmm. Yeah, that happens quite often then. <laughs> right. Then just stand there and just wait for him to come back. Okay. You might be better off looking through there. That's it. Oh, you almost had him then. I can't see him. He's here. He's right here. Right here, look. See? Here he comes. There's one right there, right there. Wait for him to come round again. There he is. Is he? Is he? I can't see. No, you missed. I can't see. I want to get a picture of a red one. I've got a picture of a red That's one. It. Did you get it? Yeah. Come on. 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 Unfortunately, you can't get no closer because of the water. I think your mum will let you go in with your trainers on. I can take them off. Okay, so you lean it forward. 
You gotta get down. Do you want me just to hold it so you don't drop it? Yeah. Lean, lean it forward. Okay, you're gonna move forward now. Because we've got a shot that's good. <laughs> I've got my foot on it. I'm putting my shoe on yours. Wait for him. There we go. No. Right, so there is my nine-year-old daughter photographing damselflies and dragonflies. What did you think of that? Was that fun? Yeah. Yeah, did you enjoy yourself? Yeah. Again, we had everything set mostly to auto. We had it set to uh, shutter pro, just so we can keep that shutter speed high, because she is very shaky. Again, she's only nine. But I think she's done a good job. What did you think of the images? Let me know in the comments below. I'm going to make sure my daughter actually reads all the comments on this video. I did like and, re and respond to it. So... Yeah, let us know what you think of the images in the comments below. I want to thank my Patreon supporters for allowing me to be able to bring you this free content. Again, if you want to check out my Patreon, check the link in the description. There's a lot on there for you. There's uh, the build log for my diffuser that I use. And there's also uh, some free Photoshop actions that you can download for editing your macro photography rig. But that's where I shall leave this video. My name's Stuart Wood. This is Jessica. And we'll see you on the next one. Right, come camera back. <laughs> Hello, my name's Jessica. Hello. Say it. Hello. Hello, my name's Jessica. Hello. Yeah? Hello. There you go. <laughs> well, this is going to be right on this, isn't it? Do you know what I mean? Oh my god. The dog's falling in the hole. On again. No. Stop making me laugh. Stop laughing. <coughs> I want to introduce to you a personal friend of mine. This is an M41A pulse rifle with upper and lower pump action grenade launcher. Feel the weight. It's not a gun. So this is what we're going to do, okay? We are going to first of all change the batteries. You're going to have to wait till he's right up on us here somewhere before you can get that shot and just go like that <coughs> and get the shot. Think off. Okay, put the square on the damselfly. He's gone. That worked with the fine, then. <laughs> <laughs>